Hello there, my name is Caitlin Maharg and welcome to my channel. I'm a narcissistic abuse survivor. My channel is all about talking about narcissism and narcissistic personality disorder and what it is like to date a narcissist. I love reacting to songs and using it as a teaching mechanism, a teaching tool to share my story and hopefully educate some of you all out there on narcissistic personality disorder. Today I'm reacting to the song Catch My Breath from Kelly Clarkson. I, I don't necessarily think she is talking about a narcissist necessarily in this song, but I think the song is empowering and it definitely was on a playlist for me after being discarded by my narcissist. I would listen to this song and I would feel hope for the future that things will be okay and that I'll, I'll I'll find myself again so yeah let's let's play this song then catch my breath stopping before it gets to the chorus but yeah she says like yeah she doesn't she's done second guessing herself she's spent her life shadow boxing her 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 own self um almost gaslighting her own self you know learning how to react to situations censoring herself questioning herself at every moment she, and she catches herself in a web of lives that people have created. This makes me think of, of being with a narcissist and the lies that they bring into your life, the manipulation, the toxicity that they bring into your life and the, what it does to you. It makes you doubt every, everything you do in life. It makes you question your self-worth when when you can't even, you never know what's real and what isn't, what's, what's true and what is a lie. And that's what, that's what being with a narcissist does. You are in a state of confusion. And that's why when you are done, when a narcissist discards you, rumination is a big side effect that a lot of people experience because you are trying to make sense of something that just doesn't make sense. And you'll the thing is no matter how much you think about it, you'll never know the whole truth. But she's she's just like saying she's like I've done so much. I've tried to, you know, guard myself so much. I've fought so much. I censored myself in life that I just I just feel like I just can't do it anymore. That's what I'm getting from this from the first verse and she's like I don't want to be left behind anymore I don't want to do this anymore I don't want to feel this way anymore let's get to the chorus now Yeah, so it does almost sound like she's talking about a narcissist. She's saying, now that you know this is my life, I won't be told what's supposed to be right. With a narcissist, they're constantly telling you who you are and what you should do and who you should be. That you, you lose yourself. You're catching your breath at every moment. Oh my God, I can't tell you how many times the literally breath was sucked out of me by comments my, my narcissist said to me out of manipulation they did to me yeah but she's saying no 
like that I'm done now that you know this is my life I'm not gonna be told what's supposed to be right you're not gonna dictate my life anymore Yeah, so she's saying she's addicted to the love we've found. And, you know, I'm, I, you know, it could be love from someone else, but I'm taking it as love within herself. She's, she's addicted to the love that she finally has within herself. This does make me feel emotional because, ah, uh, it just was a long process rediscovering myself and, yeah. Uh, let me see. What else did she say? Heavy heart now, a weightless cloud. Making time for the ones that count. I'll spend the rest. And it's like, yeah, it's like, she's like, it's just, it's simple now. Like, I can, I'm gonna make time for the ones that count. My heavy heart, my once heavy heart is now a weightless cloud. Uh, I mean, I can definitely feel this. Um, and how much I've grown throughout this whole process. Oh, okay, let's play more. My brother and I, we used to love that line, um, laughing, laughing hard with the windows down, leaving football prints all over town. Like we would, I don't know, we would sing in the car to that, laughing hard with the windows down. Hey. Just. <laughs> And that's, I mean, that's how I feel now, now that it's all said and done. I know I got emotional, but it's because I see so much growth within myself and I'm imagining the way I used to be and how I used to feel. And now I, I feel at peace in life. I walk down the street and I do things in life and I just feel happy and I do things on my terms now. I don't do it on somebody else's terms. I I just want to see and do everything and anything. And when I was with these narcissists, it felt like I was in a cage. Like, like it just, yeah, it's like you still dream of these things, but energy is being sucked out of you at all times. Like, you just don't have the energy to live the life that you truly want to, that you truly want to live and that you can live. Um, but yeah, she's like, just keep faith that karma will come around and, you know, that, that good things will come to you, that all this, the hardships that you felt in life, that you dealt with in life, it's all going to be worth it in the end. And I think I always have that air of positivity in me and... I do want to believe that, you know, being good in life, that it will be compensated towards me and I will get great things in return. And that, that is, like, that's how I feel. Like, 
Now, the good thing about like going through this experience, you know, it's easy to say that you wish you never met the narcissist, but I'm here today and I'm doing okay and I feel good in life and I mean, if anything, I can't help but always think of the things I've learned through situations. Um, I think I'm just that type of person. Um, but I now I know my worth and I know that I'll never go through any of that. Any of the stuff I went through before, I'll never go through it again. There's no way. There's no way I'd ever put myself through that. There's no way I'd ever do that. I've... I've seen freedom. I've seen, I've, I know what it's like. I, I am free. I, I never want to go back to that place I was at before because, um, because life is just so much more beautiful without someone dictating my life. So I am the one in control of my life now. She, you help me see the beauty and everything you know who knows that who she could be talking about she could be talking about a friend a lover maybe herself um god you know but she sees the beauty and everything and it used to be so much different but yeah it's just it's wonderful when you get to that place in your life when the world becomes a playground again full of dreams and possibilities. I love this song. I think it's just so empowering. And I love Kelly Clarkson. I'm pretty sure she has dated narcissists by some of her songs. It wouldn't surprise me if her father may have been a narcissist. But, oh my God, it's just so wonderful when you get, like I said, when you get to that point in your life where it's suddenly life is simple. She says, it's all so simple now, like, she, you, when you're with a narcissist and she's, when she, you know, she's talking about this in the song, like, she was second guessing herself, every, like, at one point she doubted everything she did, her life was just, life was hard, life is hard when you're dating a narcissist, nothing is simple, and there's so many times I would be with these narcissists and I was just think, why is it so hard? Why is love so hard with these men? And I would blame myself thinking that I had a problem, but no. And now that I know the truth and now that I, I see my truth inside, I see the truth of these men that I was with, it's, it's all so simple now that I'm, I, I need nobody 
that I'm great on my own and the world is just beautiful and nothing was ever my fault that I was always that I was always just wonderful and perfect in my own way even though these men made me feel differently it's just simple now I'm just gonna live my life the way I want to live it on my terms and I'm gonna love it every step of the way and I'm going to breathe in the beautiful air and just witness the beauty of of life so I, I yeah I love this song I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction if you did please give it a thumbs up and comment and subscribe so you can watch more videos on narcissism thank you for watching and I will see you all very soon bye bye